Hello everyone, I'm here to talk to you about another one of our fruits of the Spirit. This one is goodness. Our main verse for this lesson is, For it is God which worketh in you both, to will and to do of, of his good pleasure, which is Philippians 2.13. I think that goodness is one of our big, is the big lessons with our fruits of the Spirit just because it's so easy to walk and see God's goodness in everything. Your Bible story for tonight is about the creation, about how God created the earth in six days. And um, so you'll, you'll recap everything that He did on every one of those six days. And so I think that even though whenever we have our bad days, whenever we have our sad days and everything like that, we can see the goodness through it. And it, it's hard to do sometimes, but it is, it is, you are capable of it, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, in showing goodness, I want you to take a look at our pictures here that we have. I know that some of you may have heard the saying, if life gives you lemonade, or lemons, you can make lemonade. Um, so that's exactly what we're going to do. We, the pitcher of water is going to demonstrate us going through our day-to-day -day lives. The cup of lemon juice is going to represent the bad stuff, the sad stuff, the not so great stuff that happens to us on a day-to-day -day basis or sometimes all at one time. And then we have our cup of sugar, which represents God, God's love, God's mercy, God's grace for us. Um, whenever we're going through a, a day and we have a bad thing happen, you know, it, it takes a toll on us. It turns us a little blue and everything like that. Whenever another bad thing happens, a sad thing happens, it consumes us a little bit more. Whenever a lot of bad, sad, or unfortunate things happen to us in a day, then it can take over us. It can take over our day. It can ruin our whole attitude, our whole um, mentality for that day. My book's not going to cooperate with me. But if we have Jesus, if we have God's love, if we have um, the compassion of God and a good attitude, if we show, if we show some of these other um, fruits of the Spirit that we've been talking about through the lessons in, in our hearts with us, whenever this bad stuff happens, whenever this sad stuff happens, it can turn it into a not so bad situation. So if we add our little dose of Jesus, is what we're going to call it, we add that into our pitcher of lemon juice and water, and we stir it up, then we can turn this sour, bitter, and just terrible day, this terrible drink, literally speaking, into a sweet and tasty glass of lemonade. So whenever you're, you're thinking about this, whenever you have something unfortunate happen to you, whenever you're going through this lesson, I want you to think about how good you, you have it in some ways of your life. You know, whenever you think you've had a bad day, well, what's something good that's come out of it? Whenever something bad does happen, well, what, try to see the good in it. Try to see the good in any kind of situation because God's there. God's there in anything that happens to us, anything that we're going through, especially in the, the world that we're living in today. You can see God's, God's glory through it. Um, in your lesson this evening, um, like I said, you'll be talking about the creation. Um, you'll be creating again, a keychain or a bracelet. And let me tell you, it's going to take a little bit of patience with this craft. Some of you older ones or mamas and daddies may have to help the littler ones with it. Um, we have the fruits to make a keychain or a bracelet. You, can, you actually have enough to where you can make both. Um, but it may take a little bit of tweezers to, to um, get them through this hole here. So they're, they're a little stubborn whenever it comes to that. So like I said, you have enough to make a bracelet or a keychain. And then um, the fruits and actions, take a walk. Take a walk outside um, and try to see the goodness that's all around you. You know, even if it's on a rainy day, look at the flowers blooming around you. Look at the gardens growing around you. Look at the rainbow at the end of that shower and everything else. So I encourage you to um, not be negative Nancy's about it and try to see the goodness in anything that you, that you can.